Hey guys, welcome to Digit.in and in front of me at the ASUS booth, we have the company's fastest eSports display. This is the one on the left over here. It's got 300 hertz refresh rate, 1080p resolution and not sure if you really can't tell on this video just how smooth this video is. In comparison, there is another monitor over here that's running at 144 hertz and they're both being powered by not the same machine but they have their individual systems powering them but um, same spec that's the huracan over here uh, what's really cool is that okay on the back you have the very very signature rog look it's got the angry eye logo it's, i don't think that's what they officially call it but yeah it looks like an angry eye um the three leg design for the stand has got there's a mini uh, led in here with the projector lens so you have that glow and if you've actually used or seen any of the rog monitors you'll be very familiar with the design and okay so this is how you know that these are different because this one has a little copper tone this doesn't so this is the new one this is 300 hertz right 360 360 that's the one it's currently oh the 360, 360. Yep. that's correct so it's the rog 360 hertz oh my god what kind of graphic card would you need to run this well you have to keep in mind it's only 1080p and mm -hmm. you're generally playing you know csgo dota 2 right. overwatch but recommended gpu would at least be 2070 super all right. the way up to 2080 ti or titan got it wow so if guys if you're expecting to play call of duty at 1080p um full-blown graphics and expecting this sort of frame rate that's not gonna happen in order to drive this this is idly aimed at esports players who are into dota csgo uh, other esports titles and most of these guys will actually run their games at 1080p and maybe not even the highest graphics maybe at medium because for them the refresh rate matters far more so in that regard you've got you know maybe a 2070 super or something you can take and probably push this uh, monitor to the max so this is actually 24.5 inches it's a non-glare type panel 1080p resolution and supports nvidia's g-sync so which is what the original press release said the world's first 360 hertz g-sync monitor and i have to tell you guys this looks absolutely amazing you really cannot tell in this video but there is literally no blurring for me uh to my eye with this hopefully this will be coming to india very soon as of now there is no word uh, but when it does we will definitely be bringing you a full in-depth review of this monitor so thank you guys for watching this video and stay tuned for more coverage from ces